Jan said, all oh, men are alpha until their girls pull back and they start losing their marbles. Yeah. Yeah, fam. You see, you see, everyone can fake the alpha. Everyone can watch. Like, obviously, I love AMS. Yeah. That, man, yeah. AMS show, yeah. AMS is, yeah. But everyone can, this is what I'm saying. Like, this, this is the thing, yeah. No strategies and nothing like that. Nothing works long term. Yeah. Faking it till you make it doesn't work long term. Yeah. Yeah. Everyone can be alpha on the first date or whatever, in it. Yeah. Man, it's sitting there. Yeah. All leaning back and that. Yeah. Telling the girl, yeah, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that. And yeah, I don't take shit from women and that. Everyone can be alpha on the first date. Yeah. But can, can you be alpha in the long run? Yeah. Everyone can be on a first date with a gang and tell her, put the phone away. Yeah. Or I'm leaving. Yeah. And literally mean it. It will get up and leave. But that's because you don't know that girl like that. You don't care about that girl like that. You have no attachment to that girl. Can you be alpha enough that when a girl that you do love comes back into your life, but she's still on that fuckery, you're like, nah. Although this was the shot that I had probably to get this girl back, I still ain't having it. I've done it. I've done it. I've had girls on, I had a girl on a date and told her, put the phone away. She put the phone away. Cool. This was even after a man told a girl that I was invested in before that came back, tried back out the phone on the day, or was that having a meal, back at the phone at the table, put the phone away. No, I'm not putting the phone away. Okay, cool. I'm gone. Yeah. That's, yeah. Everyone can be alpha when they don't care about the girl or they don't know the girl. Can you be alpha when you're invested? Yeah. That's, that's, that's the test. That's the so all these strategies and that, they don't work in the long run. Like then people that have like, um, come out with like a one hit wonder track. Yeah, they blow up overnight. Yeah, first track, second track, they blow up. But they're just gonna fade out after a while because they ain't really like that. They ain't really got the talent. They ain't really got the skill. Yeah, they ain't got, hundred or tracks behind them and they ain't got ten mixtapes that they've been yeah that they produced over the last five, six years, whatever it? They just got lucky and blew up over the first on the first track. And yeah, I ain't gonna discredit no one, but all of that shit there that you know if you ain't really like that, yeah, you ain't gonna last long term. But that guy, he probably was all alpha on the first day and that huh. If it really was an alpha male, yeah? yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like, taking your life is so cowardly. Like, you can't deal with your problems. Yeah? As man said in that video, guilt trip you. There's people who would be dying, love to be in your position. Yeah? That's what I'm saying. Like, taking your life, committing suicide, you are a fucking pussy. I don't care what problems you're going through. I don't care if you're lonely. I don't care if you're sad and depressed. And that is not an excuse to take your life. You know how many kids are in Great Ormond Street Hospital who are going to be, you know, they've been told or their parents have been told your child's going to pass away soon. Yeah, it's only a matter of days or weeks. You know, you know how those parents, you know, those parents would be desperate for their children to be able to live a normal life, to be able to have the opportunity to make something of themselves. And you walking around all free, and you want to kill yourself just because your wife's dead, or just because you ain't got a gang, or just because you lost your job. Man, have been to war. Man, 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 have even been to war. Man, have got some kind of disease. Their legs, legs are amputated, and that. Or man, are paralyzed. They would love to be normal and functional. And you are normal and functional, and you go and kill yourself. You go and take away your life, the gift of life. Trust me, guys, you don't think, some of you might think this is a joke, like, trust me, you, you need to be thankful that you're alive, you know. The, yeah? Do not take it for granted, but you don't understand. Imagine, like, them girls in America who are locked in the man's basement for 10 years. Imagine, imagine what it would be like to be locked in someone's basement for 10 years. Just put yourself in that position. 
You've been in a cellar before, yeah? You've been in a cellar, yeah? You've been in a, a basement before, haven't you? Yeah, talking to you, yeah, the viewer right now. You've been in a basement, you've been in a cellar. Imagine what it would be like for that door that leads to the exit to the cellar to be slammed shut and locked at all times. Unless a man, you know, comes to feed you or whatever. Isn't it? Imagine what it would be like to be locked in someone's cellar for 10 years. Doing nothing, literally nothing. The man might buy you, this is not even no joke, you know. The man might buy you colouring books and shit like that. Like, this is the shit that the guy was doing to the girls, I think giving them colouring books and shit like that. Imagine not being able to see that outside world for 10 years. No TV, nothing. You ain't seen your mum for 10 years. 